Hi, in the first part of the video, I will quickly talk about working principle of our project that is thermoacoustic refrigerator. What it does is basically uh, pumping heat from cold side to hot side uh, by using sound waves as work source. We have one end open resonator tube and we drive the tube at its fundamental resonance frequency by a uh, speaker located at the open end of the tube. The appearance of displacement wave is as shown. Uh, displacement entire node is at the open end where the speaker is, and displacement node is at the closed end. The pressure wave is opposite of the displacement wave. We have pressure anti node at the closed end and pressure node at the open end. We place a stack which has gaps allowing air of motion through itself to near to the closed end of the tube where pressure oscillations are maximum. Uh, here is a view of stack. In first part of acoustic oscillation, the gas parcel at the left is displaced towards the right by the standing wave. Uh, the gas parcel is adiabatically compressed and its temperature is increased. Uh, the gas parcel therefore dumps heat to the uh, right part of the stack and shrinks. In, in the second part of acoustic oscillation, uh, the gas parcel is brought to the left and uh, it expands adiabatically and its temperature decreases. Then it takes it from the uh, left part of the stack. Therefore, until the system reaches equilibrium, heat is pumped from left part to the right part of the stack uh, with the input of work by the sound waves. Uh, let me demonstrate our setup while it's not working. Uh, power is supplied to the our amplifier circuit with the power supply. Uh, the sound signal to be amplified is provided with the online tone generator app. It supplies the resonance frequency signal to the amplifier. Uh, here is our speaker. Here is our resonator tube. Uh, here is the closed end of the resonator tube. Here is the open end of the resonator tube. Uh, air is free to uh, flow uh, inside. Uh, pressure anti node is located at the closed end, pressure node is located at the open end, St stack is located near to the closed end of the tube where pressure anti node is. Uh, there are two temperature sensors uh, above and below of the stack. Arduino records temperature values and sends them real time to the computer. After running our setup six minutes, here is the gradient value that we obtained.